I worked in finance before I really? actually, yeah, yeah, I did, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's a good reaction, yeah. yeah. You, <laughs> that's, uh, I appreciate that, yeah. So I, I, I studied, I uh, studied finance in London, and um, then went on and worked in finance for a little bit, for about six months. I lasted, and it, yeah, I, oh god, it was. I wasn't good at it, you know. And I, I wasn't know what I was doing. I was acting, which you know <laughs> was good practice. Um, but I was. It, Cut, it was a long story, but I, I'll cut it short. I was on a bus in London, and on the top deck of this bus, just me, and this girl came up, sat sort of where you are, and um, asked me if I was an actor. Mm -hmm. And I said, no, obviously not. I'm working in finance, you know, I'm going to do that. Um, but she was like, well, I'm doing a short film. I think you'd be good for this part. You, you want to audition for it? And bear, I'd never acted before, so and I was cripplingly shy as a child like literally that would be my worst fear public speaking being on stage ugh, no 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 so it was you know wasn't on my radar so but I I did audition for it and I loved it I really really loved it I, I grew up playing a lot of sport and I felt a lot of similarities between that you know sort of collaboration creating something teamwork and all this sort of stuff and it didn't matter you know being in that audition room and subsequent audition rooms it doesn't matter where you come from or your economic background or your, you know, any anything, you know. Class system's very much still alive in the UK and it's, I was always, always felt that, you know, particularly working in finance and, um, but it didn't matter. And that was something amazing, you know, for me. And, and I just loved, you know, the, just imagining all these, you know, all this stuff. And um, that, that's, that piqued my interest and eventually I, was working in finance and was hating it. So I discovered a, um, a book about acting by uh, a, stu a, a guy called William Esper, who has a studio here in New York. And I read it, loved the book. And um, I just applied to come to the school. And whilst I was in work, I applied for it. And um, yeah, they invited me to come for six weeks over the summer of 2006. No, it must have been 15 or 14. Um, and I did, yeah, and I quit my job and I came because I knew I had to do something different with my life and ended up staying for two years doing the full-time program here. And, um, yeah. And I then, love that. I mean, yeah. I think that takes a lot of uh, bravery. And I think that's a good story for people to hear that it's kind yeah. of never too late to no. find passion and no, never. to work towards something. No, 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 never. And you have to. Like, I think, you know, life, life's too short and, you know, I, I'm a, you're never going to be successful in what you do unless you love it. You know, you're just not because you put up with highs and lows in every job. It doesn't matter. There's no like, you know, it, there's n it's not an upward trajectory, you know, and working in, if you're working in a, a corporate system or whatever, there's up, ups and downs. You've got to find something that you love enough to put up with those. And I, I didn't know it was acting. I knew it wasn't what I was doing. Um, and it just happened to be acting, you know, and... Um, yeah, and I, that's what I say to people, like, you, you have to find that, like, you, you do, you know, don't stop looking for it just because you're getting older, like, you're, we're all getting older, no, don't stop looking for it, like, keep searching for it, and I did, I did a lot of stuff, you know, like, I worked in retail, I worked in, like, a yogurt shop, like, a yogurt shop for, you know, that was awful, I didn't last long there, but, you know. <laughs> what was your favourite flavour? Um, I did... I kept eating the yogurt, so I think that's why I got dismissed. <laughs>